Hello, everybody. This will be day 21 when I started a dry, dry seed. Dry start with seed. Now this is a dirted tank. There's, I'll zoom back in a little bit. It's about two inches of gravel, but in the center is all uh, high quality topsoil. So it's a planted tank. This is the carpet I laid down from some seeds I got from Amazon, like everyone has. And some people are afraid to, you know, so they've been bugging me for, God bless them, asking me for um, her updates. I said I would. It has got a, kind of gone crazy. There's this, um, I don't know his name, a Korean aquascaper. And I asked him, I said, do you ever use seeds? He goes, no, because they grow strangely. They grow out strangely. And I see what he means. You know, if I start doing some trimming now, it's going to look more like a crew cut than, a, than an afro. Here's a... We'll go down that path. That's where the big bad wolf fish lives. Red Riding Hood. But anyways, you can see how this stuff got zero light. So it's uh, I was thinking about just pulling it out. Anything that's on the edge that's not. Doing really, but it doesn't seem to be doing. If it starts turning color. I'll I'll pull it out. But um, yeah, this thing's got plenty of light. I'm doing a sponge filter with a little little pump. It's just a three gallon, guys. Sorry. For for not mentioning that for the news. And then I've got a DIY CO2 in the back and a heater. That's all I'm doing. So I don't want to trim this stuff just yet. But I will soon. Let's see if we can't get a more. Looks pretty cool. I trim it now, it's gonna look like a crew cut as opposed to, uh, well, an afro, maybe. I don't know, it's fucking awesome right now. And, uh, I'll keep you guys updated. I appreciate you hanging out. Updates in a minute. And for those who, who are just skittish about doing it, it's just a few dollars, just do it. Life's all about making mistakes and learning. If you're afraid to do that, you're afraid to live, right? Okay, sorry, no more preaching. Happy fishing.